Uh, let me get that small. Uh, just regular fries. And what's the name? Um, Coke. And what else do you say? Uh, is that the, the blazing one? Uh, no, it's just a spice. Do you want me to make that blaze? Is it hot? It's pretty hot, yes. Yeah. Right, I'll just go with the spicy. Okay, and what else do you Uh, that'll do it, brother. Or, right. you know what, um... What's up, YouTube? If you're just tuning in, you know what you're tuning in for. You're tuning in to another episode of That Unbagging. And I hope everybody's doing all right. I hope everybody's just finds you in good health and good stuff and all good spirits and all that stuff for this upcoming season, I guess. But I'm back on my... I'm back on my... On my... On my um, on my sandwich stuff. So I, I heard there was a new sandwich. So I was like, oh, shoot. I was going to check it out. And that's one thing that you know about, that you learn about stuff is like social media and stuff like that. People send me TikToks and send me stuff. Oh, you should try this or you should try that. So I was like, okay. But before we get into what we're, we're going to have to to taste test and talk about a little bit. Um, why don't you go ahead and right now and, uh, hit that little, um, that little, uh, subscribe button, that like button, hit that like button, definitely hit that like button, hit that comment if you like this content and stuff like that, and definitely, definitely, definitely right there too. Follow me on all them social medias. You can follow me on Instagram. You can follow me on, um, Facebook, um, I know there's a LinkedIn and there's stuff like that that I'm working on, trying to get more out there. But, Jack in the Box. I know I've done Jack in the Box before, and it's kind of, uh, but I've heard it was something new. And I hear that there's some other new stuff that I'm, I'm working on for y'all. But, Jack in the Box. Jack in the Box. So, you, yeah, you could say I'm, I'm back on my on my chicken stuff. Of my chicken sandwiches, uh, they they decided to drop one, and it's kind of a, it seems like a weird time to to start like uh, you know, for chicken to drop a new item, when in fact like it it seems like more restaurants are fixated on doing like big turkeys or meals already prepared for everybody, and that's like their special of the season, but that's cool that they come out with a new chicken sandwich. So without any further ado, we'll get to that. But Jack in the Box, yeah, Jack in the Box is uh, in California, San Diego sandwich spot, which you can definitely tell. So let's check it out. Unbagging. Unbagging. Mm, here we go right there guys holiday napkins as usual mm. and that uh, the spicy cluck sandwich not really into the potatoes I'm trying to stay back from the potatoes but I'm loving the I'm loving the packing you know, I don't know how many uh, Jack in the Boxes there is nowadays. It doesn't seem like there's there's that many still around. But luckily, there's one right up the block. But San Diego, that's pretty cool. That's nuts that it's that you know it's a hamburger spot, and you you would think that some hamburger spots would be bigger, like more. Um, I don't know. Like more round, but I guess the less they do, the more they get. So this is a spicy cluck sandwich, and all right. And the thing with it is, it comes with a uh, a cluck sauce, is what they call it. So it's spicy, and then there was blazing. And you know what? Before I get to that, shout out to my friends out there at Blazing Blazing Bird from Arvada. 
Oh, man. Good looking out, guys. You guys are always looking out for me. Um, like my posts and stuff like that. There's a, That's a good chicken sandwich. But this is just the fast food version. If you want a super good one, definitely check them out. Blazing Bird. They're in Inglewood, Fort Collins, um, and uh, freaking Arvada. But um, this one seems to have a sauce. A sauce. A sauce and some pickle. So that's basically what the with the with the hot bird the hot chicken tastes like and you know it's usually what it is everything you would think about it but this is it let's go for a and and let's see i think the chicken seasoned also let's give it a whirl let's see what's up Oh man. Mmm. Again. It's not too spicy. And oh man. I can't put my hand on it, but that's good. That is a good sandwich. Like the chicken's not too, like, it's not too dry, and it's but it's dry, and that's oh man. Oh man. The chicken, the sauce, it's not overpowering. There's nothing crazy about it. It's just a basic chicken sandwich with some cluck sauce. And, you know, I'm not saying that french fries are the best, but I'm just saying, like, I don't like them with some food. Sometimes you want to just, just enjoy the food. And that's how I like it. The bread's good. This is like one of them buttered breads. Mmm. With that pickle, mm, look at that. Look at that. Mm. Oh man, heck yeah, definitely, guys. I just want to say thank y'all for spending the day with me. I wanted to get you, get you a an idea of this spicy cluck sandwich. Oh man, Jack in the Box. If you're near Jack in the Box, pick one up. Pick one up late night. These will be good about four or five in the morning after a long night. Maybe an early, or after, a, you know, a long evening too. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> but heck yeah, guys. Word up to Jack in the Box. Word up to Blazing Bird. Word up to all the chicken places that I mess definitely with. Definitely good stuff. Okay. Definitely good stuff. Oh, man. Um, definitely recommend these. If you live by a, or if you're, or you're near Jack in the Box, or there's one in the neighborhood you're by, would definitely stop picking one up. Definitely good stuff. Like I said, after late nights, whatever, whatever. But yeah, yeah. But as I do about this time, don't forget to like that. Hit that little thumbs up. Leave a comment, you know, because I guess it helps the algorithm or something like that. And definitely, definitely share with your friends, whatever. And hey, definitely follow me on these social medias, Instagram, you know, YouTube already. If you do Facebook, The Hobby G Show on all platforms. So... I'm going to finish this this sandwich up, this wonderful sandwich. Thank you, Jack in the Box. But, um, hey, thanks for spending this little bit of your time with me. Until next time.